using weather as a weapon. American scientists fear the country's intelligence service might be looking for ways to control the climate. Scientist Alan Robog, he sounded the alarm after the CIA refused to explain why it was a major backer on a study on climate change. We don't know if it's possible to create a cloud in the stratosphere or to brighten clouds out over the ocean, the two ideas that people are looking at. But it might not be that difficult. We don't know. Uh, I don't know what motivates the CIA. I guess they want to protect the United States. But uh, we don't can't think of any way that you could control the climate of one part of the world without controlling the whole, the whole world. Uh, putting clouds in the stratosphere would have a global effect, not a local effect. And so uh, it's hard to think of a way it could actually be weaponized, but maybe they want to think about that. I don't know. Using weather as a weapon. American scientists fear the country's intelligence service might be looking for ways to control the climate. Scientist Alan Robog, he sounded the alarm after the CIA refused to explain why it was a major backer on a study on climate change. We don't know if it's possible to create a cloud in the stratosphere or to brighten clouds out over the ocean, the two ideas that people are looking at. But it might not be that difficult. We don't know. Uh, I don't know what motivates the CIA. I guess they want to protect the United States. But uh, we don't can't think of any way that you could control the climate of one part of the world without controlling the whole, the whole world. Uh, putting clouds in the stratosphere would have a global effect, not a 